Tony Banks says Genesis is probably over. I'm John Bowden from Rock History Music. Okay, this is not the final nail in the coffin. Things could change, but it doesn't look like they will. But anxiously waiting news of a reunion is kind of like getting a phone call from your ex-girlfriend. For a second there, you think she's going to take you back, but she just wants to borrow 20 bucks to get her new boyfriend's back waxed. We have all heard the same thing when it comes to Led Zeppelin. Not the waxing part, but the one step forward, two steps back thing where it probably will not happen. Of course, a few years ago, we had Phil Collins, Tony Banks, and Mike Rutherford go out on the road with Daryl Sturmer and Chester Thompson. It was amazing. And for the classic Genesis fans, it really wasn't what they wanted, but man, they sold out everywhere. So Ultimate Classic Rock asked Tony Banks in their exclusive interview, and we'll have a link to it, in the description of this video. They asked him the pink elephant question, is Genesis getting back together for their 50th anniversary? He said, well, I don't know. I think it's unlikely, really. I think if we're going to do anything, we should do The Silent Sun, since it's the 50th anniversary of that song. We don't really plan too much. And Peter's a terribly difficult person to tie down. I see him every so often, but he's so difficult, really even if he's enthusiastic about it. He was 20 years ago, or almost that long ago, when we did the last Genesis reunion. About five years before that, there was talk about doing something with Peter, but Peter was, and then Tony Banks laughs, originally into the idea, and then it became difficult. Even getting everyone in the same place at the same time is impossible, really. The only chance you've ever got is Phil, Mike, and I together. But even that's a long shot because Phil's not quite being where he was 20 years ago. He then goes on to say even a recording incarnation of the band right now is more fantasy than reality. Tony Banks has just released a new album in February called Five. It's an orchestral album. You can pick it up everywhere. And again, we'll have a link to the Ultimate Classic Rock interview in the description of this video. I'm John Bowden. Make sure you subscribe to our channel, share our videos, and comment on them as well. This is Rock History Music.